Hey guys, welcome to module 3. I'm Ripon Dutto. In this module, I'm going to create the related class interface and repository classes. So, let's get started. Alright, so our application. If you run the application, you will see there is an error. So, what is the error? First of all, we need to change the startup project we need to start the project which is mvc project so right click in the mvc i mean web ui then set as a startup project okay then run the application there is an error let's see what is the error actually there is no controller that's why the application cannot run so first i need to add the domain model so the domain add a folder let's say this is entities then in the entities folder right click add class or you can use shift alter c to create a class so our entity is product product make the class public okay so in the product class we will have product id name description price and category so create public integer product id get and set so we, we have a snippet which is prop p r o p then press tab twice tab one twice now as you can see this is automatically created for you a template now we need to add the name which is a string type a string and tab so it will go to the second one which is name then enter again prop going to add description which is a string type then tab which is description similarly we want to have a decimal which is price then finally i want to add a category as a string but you can add a category class as well in this demo project i'm just adding category as a string for making the application simple all right so our entity is created now what i need to do is i need to create the repository so add new folder abstract in the abstract folder shift alter c so i can add an interface which is i product repository if you don't have any idea about the repository pattern you can look at in online or i have a tutorial on repository pattern you can look at my tutorial as well so i need to make it public in the repository pattern i want to add a get method which is i enumerable and type is product so you need to add the namespace for product entity which is online shopping store domain that means this project then entities 
it means this folder then there is a product and I want to add as product in this case I want to add only get property because in this case I'm going to use to access the data through repository pattern so I don't need to add set property all right now I need to create the controller so right click in the controller then add controller mbc5 controller let's say product controller and this is a convention that controller name followed by controller so this is our product controller which is inherited from the controller class right so what I want to do is I want to create view result let's a list then I want to return view so in this case I need to pass the um, product into the view so how can I get the uh, products uh, in this case I am going to use ninject to I mean dependence injection ninject to inject the uh, repository class into the controller so what I need to do is I need to go to the ninject web, con web common and I need to register the repository into the kernel at this stage I don't have any repository implementation or entity framework so in this case I am going to use mock so mock i product repository so one thing I want to say that if I need to use this online shopping is to the domain project I need to add the reference into web UI so how can I add the uh, reference into web, API, web UI right click in the reference then add reference as you can see this is our online shopping store domain project check then ok so this is now added into our web UI project so this is here online shopping dot domain so I need to add using namespace all right let's say mock equal all right now I need to add some mocking data so mock dot setup m dot products dot return new list of product so I need to add the namespace for product this is this one okay new product name girl football price equal let's say 23 similarly then 
okay then I need to bind the mocking object into our repository or kernel so kernel dot bind and it will be i product repository dot to constant mock dot object so our mocking object is binded into the repository now what I need to do is I need to I want to use the constructor injection so I need to create a constructor the constructor I need to add product repository let's say repository or repo Oops. so I need to add the namespace for I product repository T-O-R-Y right and I need to add a private instance uh, you can use is read only product repository Oops. so repository equal repo so what we what can we do is repository dot products all right all right now build the application and let's see build succeeded so run the application and our controller is product so go to the product in the list action now as you can see we don't have any view of list that means our code is ok now we need to create the list view all right so right click in the list and add view list empty we need to add product add okay so in this case we need to add i enumerable because we will have a list of products so we can say this is products then we want to show the product so we need to add for each loop bar p in model model then division a3 let's say p dot name then the export tag I want to print price to a string as currency then I want to add description alright now run the project alright as you can see our football is the product name 
23 surfboard price running shoes 95 so that means these all values are coming from our mocking object so our mocking object is in the ninject IOC controller as you can see football 23 surfboard and running shows all right so we have created our first part I mean um, at least now we can show the value in the uh, view in the next module I'm going to show you the how to create good database and tables then finally I will display the data from database using NED framework so thank you very much for watching this tutorial please write your comment in the comment box I'd like to have a comment as a feedback 